Another problem is emerging in New Boston. Last week, we first reported how trains are blocking the intersections and tying up traffic in the area. Well, now, as Jason Colthorpe reports, an old historic bridge is out and businesses are feeling the pinch. Normally, this corner of Hannon and Huron River Drive here in New Boston is much busier, but not anymore. In fact, this ice cream shop closed early for the summer, and the rest of the businesses say they're on life support. And they say it's all because of one thing, that bridge being closed. Uh, it's devastating. The Waltz Road Bridge was supposed to be out for six months, but when business owners heard yesterday that it won't reopen for another 16 months, they had a similar reaction. Oh, boy. Wayne County closed the 93 year old bridge June 1st after an inspection revealed deterioration to the bearings. Instead of spending four million to fix it, it's spending five and a half million to replace it. A new bridge free and clear, but at quite a cost for businesses right now. Significant loss, maybe 40 to 50 percent. Another headache is there's just no easy detour for people. If you want to get here, just from the other side of the bridge, it's almost a 15 minute drive any which way you want to go all the way around. So everybody comes through here to go to the park. They're not coming through here to go to the park. So we lost a significant amount of traffic flow. It's just sad. I mean, it's, we're just a small town. Not a lot of people know good old New Boston, but it's a good town. It's a fun town. And this bridge has absolutely ruined everything. The consensus among business owners is they'll grin and bear it and hope they're still afloat when the new bridge finally opens. We got our fingers crossed. You know, we've been here for 40 years and we're very proud. You know, you know there's nothing we can do about it, so you just gotta keep on fighting. Probably the most frustrating thing for a lot of people is this bridge has been closed going on nine weeks now and still no work being done. Well, they'll get a chance to discuss that with Wayne County officials Wednesday, September 20th at 630 for a township meeting about this project. In New Boston, Jason Colthorpe, Local 4. Okay, Jason, and police say it does not hinder public safety efforts. They also say the bridge wouldn't be such a problem if it weren't for the aforementioned trains.